Medical Students Association and you are watching our PMSA channel. In line with the National Social Media Day of Folic Acid Awareness, we decided to have a crusade about the health benefits of folic acid, especially to the pregnant women. Folic acid has a lot of health advantages in our body and has recently shown to be of use to dengue patients. Folic acid is one of the B vitamins found in fruits, green leafy vegetables, and dry beans. It is known to prevent certain neural defects such as spina bifida encephalocele and anencephaly, which is why it is highly recommended for women who have reached their productive age. Other roles of folic acid include reducing the risk of developing hypertension, it helps cells resist changes in their DNA associated with the development of cancer, and it helps the body produce and maintain new cells. To enlighten you more about folic acid, we interviewed one of our doctors, Dr. Sherry Liliaris, to talk about everything you need to know about folic acid. Hello everyone, it's a privilege to educate our viewers and I'm more than happy to help raise awareness regarding the importance of folic acid in our body. Folic acid is the synthetic form of folate, a water-soluble vitamin, also known as vitamin D9. It is essential in the production and maintenance of new cells for DNA and RNA synthesis. It's especially important during periods where there is frequent cell division growth, such as in infancy and in pregnancy. Among the benefits of folic acid include reduction in the incidence of cerebrovascular diseases and even stroke. It may also prevent the onset of depression. And in infertile couples, it has been found out that folic acid improves spermatogenesis. So it's good as a supplement also in the meal. Now, anyone with a good nutrition or a balanced diet can have folic acid. Folic acid is contained in dark bean, leafy vegetables such as spinach, in citrus fruits such as lemons and oranges. Beans, legumes, and egg yolk are often rich with folic acid, and we're very lucky because certain food have been fortified with it. It includes grains, pastas, and bread. Now, some people do need it as a supplement, and this would include women desirous to get pregnant, those who are already pregnant, and those who are not eating. The recommended dose of supplementation of folic acid is 400 micrograms for those still trying to conceive and those who are already pregnant. But for women already lactating, the desired amount of this folic acid should be at least 600 micrograms. Now, the importance in pregnancy of this folic acid would be its prevention of neural tube defects such as anencephaly and spinal bifida because it also helps in the RBC production it may be of value in preventing iron deficiency anemia and folic acid deficiency. Contrary to popular belief, folic acid is for everyone but more importantly I encourage women desirous of getting pregnant and those who are already pregnant to start taking this gem of a vitamin now in order to have a good pregnancy outcome. And that's it for folic acid. May this serve as a tool for you to learn. I hope you learned a lot and you enjoyed watching. Till our next video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep you all posted. Thank you. Oh,